lot of barbers have got away from the razor only because of laziness, and they came out with with that tool, with like a, what they call a tea trimmer, that supposedly gets close, but it's not that close as as a razor can get it. So, and that came out. I think those tea 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 uh, trimmers came out in the seventies. And they were getting away from the razors, uh, shaving around when hairstyling became vogue, and they started using those. And then the, the, a lot of the older barbers got into it because, like I said, it was it was easier for them. They didn't have to sharpen the the, the razors anymore. You know, they could just use the the key trimmers. No longer did he have to hone his razor and sharpen it on the on the scruff anymore because he just could use a tea trimmer and boom 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 hit it very quickly and he's out of there. But it doesn't give you that that clean look as the the shade. And the also too is that, you know, that's the old method of doing it, you know, let's say barbering technique that went by the old, by the wayside, yeah. But I always stuck with it because it, 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 it truly leaves it cleaner and it really makes that definition in a haircut. And it, it may be, a, you know, it's a psychological thing that, you know, that the client would say, well, it lasts me longer. Well, you know, it's about the same, but maybe a couple of days difference, but it just looks cleaner and, and it looks that's the old-fashioned way of doing it.